Hey, what's going on there, YouTube? Welcome back to Charles's Toy Room and another Wednesday, which means another comic book haul. Went to Hastings this week, picked up a lot of books actually. Probably would have picked up more if they would have actually stocked them this week, which they were in the box again on the shelf. A storm play actually came up and asked me if I needed any help, and I really wanted to say, well, yeah, you can stock these, but. I really wasn't in the mood to um, tell them how to do their job. But first and foremost, I picked up the free previews book for DC Comics. I was actually really surprised that they even got this. Um, but yeah, cool, they had a few copies sitting there, so I picked one up. Um, excited to learn more about Rebirth. I did watch the um, announcement event from WonderCon. Just excited to learn more about the actual books and when they're coming out. Um, first up this week, um, I picked up Star Wars C-3PO just because I wanted to learn about the Red Arm. I'm not even sure if I'll continue this series. Um, I have some Star Wars comics in the collection, but I've not really read them or kept up. That's also why I didn't buy Poe Dameron last week. But I want to know about the Red Arm, and this apparently tells you about that, and so I wanted to learn... And if it's good, we'll continue. If not, you know, we'll see how it is. But this, I want to learn about that red arm. They finally got in a week late. Black Panther number one. So, like I said, this one came out last week, I'm pretty sure. And they finally got it in this week. It was in the box. Um, and so, glad to finally get this book. Picked up Rocket, Raccoon, and Groot number four. This is a great series. Um, they finally um, rekindled in, in the last um, issue. And so we're going to see now where they move forward um, and how they go back um, as they're presumed to be dead. Um, and so, yeah, that's exciting. Um, it's exciting too because I'm really enjoying this. Um, then picked up X-Men 92, number 2. Here he comes, Alpha Red. Um, I have not read issue 1 yet, but I also didn't want to get behind, and so I just went and picked it up. Um, probably read it, and then figure out if I'm going to continue or not. But this is X-Men 92, number 2. Picked up Moonlight, number 1, just because I was interested to see what it is. Not sure if I'll continue it or not, but just decided to pick it up to move forward with it. Um, so yeah, here is the cover. And then last but certainly not least is the unbelievable Gwenpool number one. Um, pick this up too. So there's a few number ones from Marvel this week. We'll see if I continue with this one or not. I just wanted to... I don't mind picking up number ones and seeing if I like it and then continuing them, so that's what I did. Um, the one book that I was hoping to go back and get the number one of was Mocking um, Jay or Mocking Bird. Because um, number two came out this week, but they didn't have it on the shelf, and usually they put like the previous ones behind. I was hoping they had number one. Cause I heard it was really funny, but I could not, of course, find it because it was still in a box, so I chose not to do that one. I'll go back later and see if they. Um, do have any number ones left over? Because I'll jump on in that book. Cause like I said, I heard I listened to a review and I heard it was really um, funny and had some good humor into it. So there you go. This is this week's haul. Um, stay tuned. I'm, I promise I'm going to be posting up the Dice Masters um, videos. I've just been a lot really busy with work and stuff going on, and so I'll get those posted up soon. Thank you so much for watching. Be sure to like, comment, and subscribe as always. And I'll see you in the next video. Bye for now.